people first tonight. Actor Imran Khan has stirred up the controversy on the right age to drink once again. He's filed a public interest litigation at the Bombay High Court against the Maharashtra government's move to raise that age limit on drinking from 21 to 25. Imran Khan, in fact, claiming that the legal age worldwide usually ranges between 18 and 21, also making a reference to the fact that in India you can vote at 18 years. Incidentally, Maharashtra and Delhi's drinking age limit of 25 is really amongst the highest in the world. And we can go across to the activist ang uh, actor, we can call him that now, Imran Khan. Thanks so much for joining us. And I suppose the question is, uh, certainly 25 seems like an excessive age uh, to allow uh, people to drink. But a PIL, why? Uh, the issue, honestly, for me is not one of drinking. Uh, by no means do I support, do I encourage, do I endorse the consumption of alcohol. Uh, I've, I've always tried to be very, very clear about that. The issue for me is a freedom of choice. I believe that as uh, citizens in a democratic country, it should be our, uh, our right to choose as adults to engage in any activity which is legal in this democracy. Uh, my fear is that uh, even though the intentions are noble, and while I understand uh, the state government is concerned about alcohol addiction, I am concerned about it, we are all concerned about it. I understand their intentions, but the action they are taking is, in my view, undemocratic. Uh, it, it, it begs the question that in the future, in order to protect women from being molested, what is to stop us from imposing a dress code on them? In order to uh, combat the rising pollution and the, uh, that we have in India, what is to stop them from restricting how many kilometers we drive per day? You know, Imran, you, you're saying it's about the freedom of choice, uh, but I think the question on many people's mind is why not promote something else? Why this? Why not promote youngsters? coming out to vote? Why not promote more political participation, more engagement with political leaders, or even a fight against corruption? To, uh, to answer your question, over the past three years, uh, since my first film released, every year I have participated in voter drives, uh, encouraging young people to go out and register to vote and to vote. Uh, this is something that I, I have been doing over the past three years consecutively. Uh, since you bring up corruption, another concern of mine is that uh, a law such as this will not actually stop anyone from drinking. I see a, a, a very real risk of this law increasing corruption. Anyone who, is, uh, who wants to drink will continue to drink. They will get their uh, alcohol through illicit sources, through, through the black market, through bootleggers. You will flourish, uh, a criminal trade will flourish where there had not, had not been one before. Anyone who is caught will bribe their way out of the situation. You will be increasing corruption, you will be increasing crime. Uh, th there are just so many ways for this to go wrong. Uh, it, it's startling to me that no one has thought of it. Okay, that's a fair point, Imran Khan. And in fact, on Twitter, we've been asking our uh, viewers just how old they were when they took their first drink. And I can assure you, none of the answers is 25 and above. They've all been uh, younger. But there are many who would say that really filing this PIL is as much about winning popularity amongst your young fans. What would you say to them? I mean, uh, th there's been so much talk about uh, a publicity gimmick and, and whatnot. Uh, that is actually part of the reason that I waited. Uh, my two films for this year have already released, they've done very well. Uh, there is no need for me to get any kind of publicity. Uh, I, I could just as easily not spend this time and effort and money uh, and, and not stir up any kind of controversy. There, there are far easier ways for me to get my, my, my picture in the paper. I think fair enough. We'll take that argument. And finally, if I may pose the question that Suhasni mentioned, how old were you when you had that first drink? Uh, I had my first drink actually with my parents on my 18th birthday. Uh, they, they, they had talked about it and they said, look, if you want to have a party, if you, want to, if you actually want to drink, you should do it in a controlled, in a safe environment. At home, we are here. Go ahead, drink, try it. Uh, if something goes wrong, if you should uh, feel unwell, if something bad happens, we're here. Uh, you're, you're in a safe environment where people can look after you.